Let's talk about oysters. They play a vital role in coastal communities from our economics to our environment. But what happens when oysters are faced with hazards like chemicals? Our Cheriston Clark spoke with a former College of Charleston grad student about his research on oysters and the hazards they face. Cheriston, this is very interesting. It's very interesting, very surprising, especially for people who may be new to the area. From 2020 to 2023, Jonathan Stewart researched the toxicity of firefighting foams to oysters. His goal to help our waters can hope our waters can stay as clean as possible. Oysters, they play an important role within our ecosystems. Things like oyster reefs provide huge benefits to us in keeping our harbors healthy. Which is why Stewart focused his research on the hazards they face. Yeah, so I started graduate school at the College of Charleston in 2019 and I came in wanting to look at oysters and oyster larvae and how things like personal care products that come out of our wastewater treatment plants can impact their dispersal and how interconnected the oyster reefs are. That also includes how firefighting foam can be hazardous to the oysters. So we brought them back in the lab, we cleaned them up, we held them for a little bit, and then what we ended up doing was we shaved off some of the shell and then we exposed them to some of the firefighting foam. And this gives us an idea of how exposure might affect the shell regrowth process and help us understand what the impacts of these new foams might be on our coastal ecosystems. While some of the research is still unpublished, he was able to see how these new products affect oysters. We ended up learning what some of the effects of these new PFAS-free firefighting foams might be if they end up getting adopted, stuff like that. As for alternatives to the foam? So the goal of our research has been to figure out if the replacements are going to be more of an issue than the problem they're solving. And our goal is to make sure that's not going to happen. We want things that are overall less toxic and less hazardous to the environment and to human health.